everybody, welcome back to the Chaotic Little Book Corner. My name's Acacia. Today I'm going to be doing the Totally Should Have tag. And I wasn't tagged by anyone, I just found it and I liked it. Totally should have gotten a sequel. The Night Circus, guys. Like, this should have been a series. I never wanted to leave this world. I don't even care if they have the same characters in every single one. I just want to stay in this world forever. I love this world. Oh. So beautiful, but this totally should have had a sequel. The next one was totally should have had a spinoff. And I think Annihilation by Jeff Vandermeer should have totally had a spinoff because this series was the Southern Reach trilogy and it was phenomenal. And I want to know more because this, oh, so good. So good. I love this. This is the, like one of the only sci-fi books that I seriously adored and I picked it up on a whim because I loved the, the side and the way that all three of the books looked next to each other. And it was totally worth it and totally in love with it. And yes, need more. Totally should have written more books. And that's Ishbel B. T definitely should have written more books. And I hope she does. This is Ishbel B. She did the Contrary Terror of the Butterfly Girl and also the... The Singularly Extraordinary Tale of Mira and Goliath. And I loved those two books. And I just want more. I want more. So much more. I, I really would like her to stick with that series, though. I really would like to stick with that series and just keep going. Um, a character who should have ended up with someone else. I don't care. I'm going to have a couple of those in this video. Because I really feel like there are certain things that it's not my place to tell the author how to do it. I believe that they did it for a reason. And that's one. Like, I really think that the author goes in there knowing who they want, who to end up with, and it's not my place to tell them that they shouldn't. Even though I really think Neville and, and, and Luna should have ended up together. But that's okay. That's okay. Totally should have had a different ending. Again, I don't think it's my place. Harry Potter could have done without the epilogue. But other than that, I think, yeah. Totally should have had a movie. It may yet, but I don't know. Alice in the Fly by James Rice. This book was phenomenal. I loved it. It's totally a great mix between a man with schizophrenia, the idea of the kind of perks of being a wallflower style writing. It was, oh, so good. And I just, I think this would make a great film. I really do. Totally should have had a TV series. Soulless. So the Parasol Protector series by Gail Carriger. Any Gail Carriger book should have had a TV series because I'd love to go into Victorian England with all these werewolves and vampires and goodness and just live in that world forever. That was creepy. But I would. I would really enjoy being in this world. But if, if they ever make anything about this and Alexia's not plus size, I'm going to be pissed. So angry. She's not a skinny girl. Don't make her skinny. Should have had only one point of view. I can't think of any books where I've read that are multiple perspectives that I felt it wasn't necessary. So that's my answer there. Should change the cover. Should have changed the cover. Um, Shutter Island is really the only one I could think of, but it's because I don't like any of the covers they have. I really want a more, I don't know. I want something better. I want a better cover. I haven't found one I love. I want something better. And I would totally buy it in some sort of limited edition goodness because I love that book. Should have kept the old cover. Um, any book that changed to the movie cover should have kept the old cover. I don't have the same logic where I'm like, oh, I visualize these two people in the book. I just think it looks cheesy when it's the movie cover. I don't know. Especially when it's got all the character, like, like the actors names on it like I just doesn't really impress me and then totally should have stopped at book one I don't know because if I only like one book I stop at book one so I can't remember all the books that I have that haven't stopped at book one if I don't like if I if book one you know is good enough for me I just stop there <laughs> I don't keep going. It just doesn't occur to me to keep going if I don't really want to. I really would love to know Paige and Amanda and Britney's should have because I would be fascinated. And actually, Mercedes 
Mercedes from Mercy's Book of Musings. I would love to know what she thinks should have been different because she usually has pretty strong opinions about how things should be different. And I would love to know what she thinks should have been different. Yes. So Mercy, Brittany, Amanda, and Paige. Down below, I'll link all their channels. I love you guys. I will see you in my next video.